The daily scrum is a meeting of 15 minutes max. During the daily scrum, a scrum team aligns their work by sharing status, signaling impediments and replanning towards sprint success. Dear Scrum Master, yesterday I did what you told me to do. What do you want me to do today? A common mistake is that the Scrum Master acts as a project manager and a team reports to the Scrum Master each daily scrum. This is not the way it should be. The daily scrum is a team meeting. Make sure that the team reports to each other. Come on guys, we're late. We have got only 9 minutes left for the daily scrum. A common mistake is that the daily scrum is not a habit. It varies over time, location, people and duration. Make sure the meeting is always the same location and starts exactly at the same time. Oh, and don't forget, the meeting ends after 15 minutes, no matter what. Yesterday I've been working on my framework, which I've been working on for the last couple of days. I'll be continuing today and probably for the next couple of days. So uh, yeah, fine by me. No impediments. Good. A common mistake is that the team is reporting on tasks and tracking their progress at task level. However, the goal of a sprint is working and tested software. So in fact, the daily scrum is a replanning meeting. Replan every day to ensure you reach a sprint goal. And uh, Frans, have you taped it? Yeah, really, it's a wrap. And what do you think about it? Well, these are some nice problems, man, with the daily stand-up. But how to do it better? Better? Tip one. The daily scrum is the most important meeting of the day. Make sure that everybody is there. So when the daily scrum starts at nine, agree to be in the office at a quarter to nine. In case you are a few minutes late in the office, then the daily scrum can still start on time. Tip 2. Prevent the daily scrum to become boring. Very. One ID, use a talking stick. The one with the stick talks, pass the stick to the person you want. Or vary with the questions. You don't want the daily scrum to become a zombie meeting. Try to make it a fun meeting. Tip 3. The purpose of the daily scrum is that everybody keeps an eye on the goal. So make clearly explicit what will be delivered at the end of the sprint. Everybody should understand that after the daily scrum. Every day. Make sure that this is clear. Tip 4. The daily scrum meeting is a meeting for the team. They align their work, they discuss progress and they replan if necessary. So make it a team meeting. As a scrum master, step out of the circle or stay away at least once a while. Just observe what happens. It should be a meeting of the team. Tip Five. Make a clear distinction between signaling a problem and solving it in the daily scrum. Signaling a problem is fine. Discussing the solution, however, is mostly not feasible. You only have 15 minutes max. So, park solving a problem till after the daily scrum. Signaling is fine, but then continue. This video blog is sponsored by ProWareness.